MailChimp landing page tutorial creating a high converting landing page for free. Hello guys, Celia here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we easily build our landing page on MailChimp. So here we are on MailChimp.co, let's go to our dashboard to start creating. Basically it's not that hard, let's click on create in the left top corner and here on creating page we just simply need to choose landing page in the left side menu and uh, here we can start our creation we need to select the landing page name so let it be like landing page one for example and we also need to select an audience i have this audience here so let it be like this let's click on begin and we'll come to the next uh, stage basically where we can find a lot of uh, different templates we can easily use. So basically we have like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 templates which are available for free. So we can use uh, every template which is uh, suitable as for us. So let's try to view how does it look like. For example, this one, we can just simply click on view in the right top corner of the icon. And now it looks like this. It's totally responsive. So we can switch between different devices. And as you can see, it was successfully like adopted. So I think it's pretty cool. We can close this icon and let's click on it to use this template these templates may include placeholder stock images and copy before you can use a template you must accept an additional term so let's click on accept and uh, we can try to use it once more so let's click and in a few seconds uh, we'll come to our like uh, editor page where we can start creating where we can start our customization and as you can see now it looks like this so uh, in the left side of our editor we can find how does it uh, how does it look like basically how does our landing page look like we can simply find all the elements we can try to hover and um, discover all the sections we have and in the right side there is the option to interact with different blocks different objects so from this page here we can simply add a text box text divider images image group image card and so on so uh, moreover if you'll click on some icons we can just simply uh, use and just e interact with different stuff so basically for example if you want to change this text we can just simply click and then in the right side menu there is different properties for this text so let's try to change it for example thanks for sub i'm going to create a landing page for the subscribers thanks for sub i'm going to make it bold italic and i also want to increase the size so let it be maybe like 50 right up here and also we'll try to find uh, we'll try to change the text a color let it be like maybe yellow or orange something like this the next step i want to do is just to change this description we'll write something short for example welcome on this channel let it be like this for example and also I'm going to customize, let's make it bold. I'm going to change the color. So let it be, for example, blue. I'm just showing all the features so you can uh, try to add something by yourself. So let's also add maybe image. I want to add me image. And how can we add? Just simply click on image, I think. And from this page, we can find uh, something. I have only one applause. So let's try to use this t-shirt as a background maybe so yeah let it be like this why not so if you are going to interact with more things we can just simply change the color so we can make it for example a red let's try to find is there will something change or not so nothing is changes yeah because we don't have like png version and in this case we can just simply interact with every single element i want to add a text here so basically let's click on save and close and I want to add the image here, for example. So we can just simply click on upload and then just upload it from our files or with creative assistance. So there are a lot of options basically we can use. 
or we can try to upload these gifts so let's try to use something which is suitable as for us for example let it be this one here let's click on insert and in this case we can interact with it so we have like this we can decrease the size and um, there are also a lot of things we can work for example we can interact with this like team section where we can manage all the stuff so the column one and the column two so for example column one let's change the name from dave to john for example also like atlanta and uh, we can also change the description let it be like channel owner let it be like this and for the megan let it be let's try to switch to column two it will be like uh erica and also from san diego and let it be like writer so in this case we can interact with every single element here also like change these uh, background change this text uh, make it like more suitable as for our theme but this is a way of how can we work with landing pages on mailchimp and if everything is ready or maybe you want to stop our work we can just simply click on save in close and the right bottom corner and our landing page will be successfully saved yeah and we can easily find it in our like landing page uh, option so basically it will be right up here we can now click on publish and it will be published to the internet basically i think so now yeah we can share it by simply click on this button and as you can see it looks like this everything was customized what did we change and now we can even share this link to the to all the guys so basically this is the way of how can we uh, interact with landing pages what to do next track how your landing page performs turn on tracking to stay up to date on how your page is performing so we can just simply click on edit to go to uh, landing page options and then uh, we can just simply try to settings and edit click on it right up here enable restricted data processing enable limited data track with google analytics and also like do some other stuff so uh, basically this is a way of how can we interact with landing pages on mailchimp i hope guys this video helped you out if it is please leave a like comment and subscribe i wish you a very good day if you have any questions you can write them in the comments below bye